Hey, Chemitech and everyone else. Just showing off my Etch-a-Sketch build as per the plans I gave Happy Bob and his original idea for a shakeable calculator Etch-a-Sketch. So here's the device, normal TI-84+. plus. The device at the top is the Etch-a-Sketch thing. You can see there's a little spring and a pin in there. So when you shake it, the pin stays fixed and the spring moves back and forth, touching the pin and completing a circuit. There's a blob of hot glue on the end that weights down the spring and makes it move back and forth with more inertia when you shake the calculator. And of course there's a standard, actually it's part of an old broken silver link that connects to the I.O. port. Um, it connects a circuit to pull one of the link lines low, which I can detect through assembly. So I am going to, of course, open up my favorite shell, Dorsey S. And I crashed my calculator recently, so we'll just skip past that. So you'll see the Etch Sketch program is at the bottom of the screen here. And if I just scroll over to it, we have Etch Sketch 252 bytes, in case you can't read that. So pretty small. It supports diagonal lines, shake erasing, and that's about it. Oh, and of course, if you don't have the device attached to the top, you can also press clear to clear the screen. So, basic thing here, I'm just going to quick, I'll show you, da -da -da, look lines, amazing, so cool, oh my gosh, it's an etch sketch, wow, isn't that amazing, alright great, I'm going to clear the screen and write something on it, so I'll write a little hello to you guys. And my etch sketch program uses incremental erasing. So every time you shake it, it erases 16 random rows and columns of the display, which I thought would be a little more realistic. And independently, uh, Happy Bob came up with the same idea. So here I've written hello on the display. So I'm just going to shake it a little bit. And you'll see that it's starting to erase a little bit. Shake it a little more. A little bit more erased. Shake it a bit more. And it's almost all gone, just a few little pixels left. Check a few more times. Not quite gone. And it's all gone now. So, that's how it works, and then I can just start drawing again, drawing again, drawing again. And then I could just shake to erase again. And it kind of fades away, a few little pixels left, just like in a real X sketch, it's a bit annoying. Now it's all gone, and I can just press mode, and I'm right back in door CS. So, hope you enjoyed that. Props to Happy Bob for the original idea. Thanks for watching. Lean the way to the future.